Good morning, guys. Listen, there's one thing I don't like, and that is celery. Um, but I understand that celery is good for you. So I'm going to, of course, put it in my juicer, and I'm going to make juice out of it. But I'm going to mix some apples with it, Macintosh apples. And I had a big, huge Granny Smith apple left over that needed to be used. So I'm going to put that in there, too. So I'm going to make some celery and apple juice. All right. I also heard it helps you to lose weight, so we'll see. All right, I have my apples cut up, and as you can see, the air has already started to hit them, and they're already starting to turn brown. Um, but, but we're going to go ahead and put them in the juicer with the celery and see what we have, see what we get. Make sure you pull your celery apart and wash it because sometimes there's dirt in between right in here, so you want to make sure that you wash it really good. So I pull mine apart and wash it before I start juicing it. All right, here we go. So I'm going to drink a little bit of it. Not bad. It's actually not bad at all. I could do this. I could do this. That's pretty good. I could do that. So this was actually a whole stock of celery. And I cut up two Macintosh apples and one Granny Smith apple. It's amazing that that whole stock of celery, because it was huge, only produced this small amount of juice. Wow. I'm gonna drink a cup in the morning, and I'm gonna drink a cup at night. And let's see what it does. It's supposed to help you lose weight, but um, also, it's a, a very good detox for your liver. And look, in the comment section, write some other things that you've discovered celery is good for, just so we can help folk out. All right, there you have it.